few days ago, Atlas released the Persona 5 anime special, Daybreakers. Produced by A1 Pictures, with Takahara Ozaki taking the helm as director, Daybreakers is a prologue to the game, which comes out on the 14th in Japan. Daybreakers tells an interesting story during its short runtime. It establishes the Phantom Thieves of Heart, a vigilante group made of the protagonist nicknamed Joker, and Yusuke, Yuji, and Kat Morgana. The special ropes the viewer in with its clever script, written by Shinichi Inotsume, and pulls some surprising bait and switches along the way. It really showed the wits of the Phantom Thieves, while leaving room for the game to develop these characters more. Daybreaker's narrative is supplemented by its engaging visuals. The character designs, originally done by Shigenori Sojima and adapted by Yahagi and Matsumoto, are pretty simple but match up with the characters' personalities. There is also some beautiful background art, done by studios such as Studio Uni and Art Team Convoy, with a lot of detail and a wide array of vibrant colors. They manage to both steal the scene and leave proper room for the characters. Alongside the visuals is some impressive animation. From overhead zooms to smooth panning shots, it provides a variety of engaging cuts. Also, there are some beautiful special effects, including flames and smoke. Finally, the Persona scenes are among the best work in Daybreakers. Without a doubt, the animation is one of the special's highlights. As expected with Persona, the music is spectacular. It complements the suspense and action, and is quite groovy. Persona 5's theme, Wake Up, Get Up, Get Out There, composed by Shoji Maguro and performed by Lin, serves as the ending song for this special. It's right up there with the previous Persona themes, and it makes me excited to hear the whole Persona 5 soundtrack. All in all, Daybreakers is a well-crafted introduction into the world of Persona 5. With a concise story, great art style, fitting music, and interesting shots, it got me quite excited to see where the game will go from here. I highly recommend it, especially for people who plan to play Persona 5. If you want to give it a watch, you can find Daybreakers on Crunchyroll. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And if you want more content, check out my video on the Sonic OVA, or go to the Anyfix Podcast. See you guys again soon.